Hello YouTube, Hillman here, and welcome to the first episode of A Brog and a Brew. The Brog is a number 33 boxer, and in it I am smoking some Irish Aromatic from Yulee's Tobacco Shop in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Uh, this is a very light aromatic, has a really nice Irish, uh, Bailey's Irish cream flavor to it, and the creaminess really brings out a lot of these October style, uh, Oktoberfest style beers that uh, I'm going to be reviewing one of those today. Uh, what I'm going to be reviewing is from Shiner, the Shiner Oktoberfest. It's a Marzen style beer, and here in Texas it runs at a 5.8% alcohol by volume. Five uh, percent. It has a really mild, nice uh, malt flavor to it. Uh, the hops are very, very light. The uh, malt is though is really crisp. This has a very nice drinkability, and the, the Irish aromatic really brings out that maltiness. is very bready, uh, really delicious. Goes down really smooth. Has a real nice. Uh, clean finish on it and if you start drinking one you'll want to drink more they are that uh, drinkable uh, I'm going to use a zero to uh, five rating system on these reviews I'm going to give this one a three and a half I wish it had a little bit more of a hop bite to it uh, the hops are not near as bitey as I, I would like but uh, the smoothness and the drinkability is, is really, really good. It has a really nice clear amber color to it. A very light head. But it does have some really nice carbonation and it laces your glass really, really well. Good for when it's this cut, the temperature outside is not really, really cold enough. I really enjoy heavy, heavy stouts uh, during the wintertime. But in the fall, it, temperatures are getting up in the afternoon, like into the 60s or low 70s. And so something like an Oktoberfest is perfect for this time of year where you, you get, uh, you know, a little bit something more than what you would drink in the summer, say like a cream ale or a, or a, a light ale and you want to transition into the fall and into the winter with something a little bit heavier that really fills you up and gets that alcohol rolling and kind of warms you up on the inside. So this is really great for that. Uh, if this is available in your area and it sounds like something that you would enjoy, uh, I encourage you to go out and get you some and try it. And I believe that uh, you're going to probably enjoy it. Uh, next up is going to be Episode number two coming up is going to be another Oktoberfest. This was going to be a Samuel Adams Oktoberfest, and it is a lot different than this one. Where this one is mild, it's a little bit, it's a step above, and it's a little bit better. So look forward to episode number two. Sure. Thanks for joining me. And until we share another bowl together and another brew... Peace.